Hello again my friends and today another Destiny related video. I know I just posted a couple Destiny related videos onto the channel but this one's so important that I have to get it onto the channel for you guys to see. Now if you pre-order the Rise of Iron expansion you will get the Iron Gallahorn. Also if you don't pre-order you can still get the Gallahorn it's just the original version. There's also a theory on my channel that you can go check out to view whether the Iron Gallahorn and the Gallahorn are the exact same weapons and if there's a possibility of a theory where there's also gun shaders now in the new Rise of Iron. Now again, there's also some more things that I want to talk about. So if you pre-order the Rise of Iron DLC, the DLC costs $30. If you pre-order it at GameStop, you will get this poster. The backside showing the Iron Gallahorn and the stats perks and lore behind the weapon. Now the normal Gallahorn that we know and love is the white and gold version. The black and silver version though has some lore behind it as posted on this photo and it states the exotic rocket launcher Iron Gallahorn forged from the armor of thousands who fell at the Battle of Twilight Gap. To wield Gallahorn is to wield honor against any attempt to our extinction. Many guardians still seek this weapon, but only those who honor our past will see it forged anew in black fire by the last of the Iron Lords. That is fucking amazing, badass, and I cannot wait. This gun is absolutely beautiful, and I cannot wait to get my fucking hands on it. Now, with this information of the Iron Gallahorn, we also have information on the perks, the stats, and what this gun is going to bring to us. Now, in comparison to the normal Gallahorn, as of the year one stats, the velocity on this isn't as high as it used to be. It dropped down from 90% velocity down to about 50 to 54%. Also, if you want to look at the reload speed, the reload speed also dropped a little bit from the normal 69% down to roughly about 45. Again, the blast radius also stayed very much the same at that 90 to 95% range. So the velocity and the blast radius combined together is really what makes this gun devastating, along with the Wolfpack rounds. Now, the original Gallahorn used to have Wolfpack rounds back in year one. This gun, as you can see by the Wolf symbol next to it on the poster, it definitely does have Wolfpack rounds. Also, we can see by another perk symbol that it does have tracking and increased velocity and the exact same perks as it did in year one. So the gun all in all didn't change very much with the perks, only the stats changed a little bit to even it out from its destructive power before. The velocity beforehand was way too strong. They lowered the velocity, increased the blast radius, and all around this is still a goddamn amazing exotic to own and I can't wait to get my hands on it. Now, if the stats for the normal Gallahorn stay the exact same as this Iron Gallahorn on the poster, I would be safe to say that my theory still stands and there's going to be gun shaders and the original Gallahorn will be forged in iron in the black fires of the Iron Lords by simply putting a shader on the normal Gallahorn. I don't really know, Guardians. If you have any ideas and comments, please leave them down below in that comment section. And again, Guardians, we'll see you all in the next video. Pre-order Destiny Rise of Iron and get the Iron Gallarhorn.